How's everyone doing? I'm Trey Wilcox and you're watching Two Minutes with Trey. Today I'm gonna to be working with one of my favorite ingredients. It's called beef short ribs, baby. Any type of beef is one of my favorites. I am a Texas boy, so I always love beef, but I gotta tell you, nothing better than slow and low. So what I like about bone-in short ribs is that when you cook a piece of meat on the bone, whether it be chicken, beef, uh, veal, all those meats pick up a little bit more flavor when they're cooked on the bone. After I remove this top layer of fat, don't worry, there's still gonna be enough fat to keep this short rib delicious. Now I wanna to switch to a bony knife and I wanna come in here and remove the silver skin. So, I got salt, pepper on my short rib here. I'm gonna add this to the pan and then I'm gonna put it in my mirepoix vegetables, red wine, beef stock, all of that into the oven. Cook it for, I like to go 275, three hours. Had plain potatoes, just salt and, a little salt and pepper. Today I'm gonna add black truffle butter. If you wanna add a little bit of truffle oil, you can. I know everyone has their thoughts and feels about truffle oil. Um, this is a particularly very good brand from a company called Foods and Season. And peel the outside layers of the leaves of the artichoke off. I peel the outside layers, cut the stem off, cut the bottom, and then boom. My chanterelles, I'm actually gonna let them stay in this shape, this size. I'm not going to destroy that beautiful, natural look that they have. So I'm gonna add my mushrooms first. Mushrooms, very high in water content, so you wanna make sure you kinda use a hot pan. Then I'm gonna add my artichokes. Okay, my artichokes, I'm gonna start them cut side down so I can get a really nice char on them as well. My chopped garlic, I'm gonna add. Give it a really quick toss, and then I want to deglaze it with a little bit of water. You know, just a nice dollop of those in the corner. I'm gonna remove one piece of the meat from the pan, and this is the piece that I take, I've taken the bone off intentionally, so we don't want it to fill a person's plate up with just bones. And then the other piece of meat, you can see that I've left that bone intact. Artichokes aren't a very easy item to work with, so we want to make sure that we, we don't really destroy them in a the pan. The mushrooms, nice crispy texture, so that the sauce now is my glaze for this dish. I mean, this is your true fall, winter, you know, warm you from the inside out kind of dish right here, man. I mean, this is good stuff. 